Hey, it's Phantom from BSA, BSA Airsoft, and today I'm going to be giving a review of my KWSR-10. First off, it comes in this nice box with a KWA symbol and engineered to outperform, which KWA always does. And inside, you got your normal styrofoam casing, and it comes with a little bag that has your manual for all the uh, SR-10 cores. And you've got your LiPo ready warranty and your warranty. And it comes with a little KWA decal. Then it comes with a little orange plastic plug. Uh, unjamming rod, it's always useful. Two Allen keys and hop up adjustment tool. Uh, it comes with a 350 round metal high cap magazine, uh, front and rear sight that are adjustable and you can take them off as I did. And then this is a gun, it's a really nice gun. Out of my three AEGs, this is probably my favorite and one, probably the best. Overall with the crane stock full extended, it's about 33 and a half inches, which is kind of long, so I don't really have it shortened. Uh, inner barrel length is 425 millimeters, which is from the hop up right here to about the end of the flash hider. This is 6.05 diameter uh, bore, so it's pretty good. Uh, just stock, it weighs about 6.55 pounds, but mine weighs a little bit more because we've got Echo 1 M203, which is heavy. Uh, it shoots around 20 rounds per second, so this thing will fly through a mag. I went through a mag in about 6 seconds. A lot better than my old gun. Uh, FPS 390 to 410, depending on your chrono, what kind of BBs you use. I know we run point uh, two threes, and I'm going about 390. Uh, it's a 2GX gearbox, so another KWA feature. Uh, free float rail system, I think it's about 10 inches, and it's the SR10. Uh, CNC crafted, and then it has a little. Uh, White letters saying KWA USA, City of Industry, California, USA. It has uh, all the rail stocks are numbered, so you know where you're putting your things. Uh, and then the paint job on this, it does not scratch. I mean, I feel this thing maybe for three events, I don't have a scratch on it except for the sling. Uh, going on to the crane stock, six position, good for zero to five. Then a uh, very unique feature is the uh, type of battery in. Just pop up two little tabs right there. Plug in your battery. You can change your battery in 20 seconds, which is really nice. If you're in a firefight, you need to change your battery. All right, let's go do a shooting test. Alright, now for the shooting test of the KWSR10. I'll be using an 8.4 1500 mAh battery, which I normally run at 9.6 mAh, but I didn't want to charge that. Alright, so here's semi. And then full auto. I was using my Magpul P Mag for that and did some damage to the bag. Now I'm going to shoot my Echo 1 M203 because I haven't shot it yet and I really want to. Alright, see how this thing works. Alright, 3, 2, 1. Oh yeah. As you can see, that did a lot of damage to this paper bag. And a few things I forgot to mention. One, I was doing a shooting test in my kitchen because it's Ohio, so the weather is always really bad and it's raining. And two, always wear eye protection when you're shooting an airsoft gun and don't shoot at people who don't have the eye protection. And I was using the Magpul P Mag for the shooting test, not the high cap that it comes with. So, hope you enjoy the review.